Bum, 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 bum. Hello, rat bags. It's Jade. Welcome. I am kicking off uh, something a bit different today. I decided I want to play something that I really fancy playing, and with a bit of purpose as well. So yes, this game is better than well. Don't at me. Don't at me. Ooh. Oh yeah. Hello, V. <laughs> Timothy. Angus, I best. Walk one. Ooh. These are the heroes from the first game, I do believe. I think they're about to get their asses handed to them. Exactly what the F is Torchlight? Exactly. This is crazy. This is... Do you know everyone that's playing lots of like Diablo style games or uh, Pillars of Eternity, stuff like that? This was like the original one. You either played Diablo or you played Torchlight back in the day. It's coming to console Tuesday. It came out on PC seven years ago. Oh man, they, they've got their asses handed to them. That's it. We need new heroes. I didn't realise it was such a lengthy intro. It's good. I realise the sound may be a bit loud. Heroes may fall. Hope may fade. But new heroes will rise. Ooh. Feels a bit like Fabulous there. Torchlight 2, baby. Let's go. So it's an old school RPG. I'm praying I can use my control pads. No, it doesn't look like I can. I'm going to cry my eyes out if I can't use the controller. I don't want to be using the keyboard and mouse. Keyboard and mouse sucks. Don't at me. Don't at me. Yeah, it's not even coming on now. Why is it not even coming on? Come on now. Come on now. Oh, oh there we go. It wasn't connected properly. Maybe I can... No. Maybe I can map some shit. Should we try mapping some stuff? Because if I have to use a uh, keyboard and mouse, it's not going to be pretty. Okay, move attack. Let's try that. We'll... Press a map or key. No, you can't. Alright, I'm going to have to try it with just the keyboard and mouse. So I'm playing on PC. This comes out on Tuesday. I'm hoping I'm going to get a copy of it on console to show you guys what it's all about. It's just been ported over to console for Xbox, PlayStation, and that's all I know about it. Um, but this is this is like old school RPG. -ing. I used to love the first one. I've never played the second one properly. The first one was one of them games I played on Xbox 360 back in the day. And I had put a good a good 50 hours into that game. And that might not sound like that much, but it's quite you know, it's quite a repetitive game, grindy game, maybe even more. I did complete it once, and I was trying to get all the achievements for it and stuff. So I might even I've got a character here. I'm like a mage character, that's what I've gone for. Um, but there's there's all sorts, there's four classes, typical sort of berserker, mage, ranger. They're the sort of things you'd come to expect. Morbids! Hello, mate. How are you doing, bud? Um, it's around $16. Yeah, so $20 for Xbox. £16 in UK on Xbox. So about $20 on PlayStation 4. And the Switch. This would be a great game if you got on Switch. I promise you now, you're going to have loads of fun. I mean, as long as it's ported well. After seven years, I think so. It's the same team that ported over... What did they port over? They may have been the ones that ported over Wolfenstein to Switch. So yeah, so you got my health, you got my mana. That's like your magic abilities. You've got potions that you drink up. Um, you've got your weapons. I've got two skills, my basic attack, and then I've got my magma spear. Okay? You two are lucky to have made it this far, seeing how badly wounded the destroyer is. 
but I think you're on our own now from here to the Enclave. The destroyer can barely stand, let alone fight his way through all those Sternborn in the pass. Okay, cool. It is going to take me a while to get used to keyboard and mouse in. I've, I've never done it. So that's me little fire attack. And that's... Oh, nothing's really happening now. I've just got that one attack. Can I scroll through? Where's the other... Oh, yeah, that's just me, me staff then. Select a skill. It's a basic attack. Your basic attack. Magma Spear. Okay. Magma Spear, Magma Spear. It is exactly like Diablo. It, so, history lesson while we're going on, while I'm still getting used to it, because it's been a while. Um, Diablo came out, everyone loves Diablo. Diablo 2 came out, everyone loved it, or whatever. Diablo 3 came out, everyone hated it. And at exactly the same time as Diablo 3, everyone hating on that game, Torchlight came out. And it was like a bit of a copy, bit of a copycat. And people just went nuts for it. Like People really were like, oh my god, this game's amazing. Um, so, I've got my staff there, but I don't know how to uh, shift-click to transfer. Okay, so that's just move. Alright, I'll try and get used to it. I'll try and get used to the controls. Sorry if I'm being derpy, but it's just the way it is. I think this is as far as I can go. You should carry on to the Asterian Enclave, but you're on your own. Warn them that the Alchemist destroyed Torchlight and is headed their way. He may be there already. Cool. Okay, so we'll do, we'll do that quest. Got a new quest. We'll get going. And you can zoom in a bit more, so you know we we could have it as that view. I don't think you can change the camera angle all the way around. So you can zoom right out. Got a little mini map in the corner there. I'm just seeing. Make sure the camera. Got my doggo. I don't know if we can pet the doggo. We might not be able to, which might piece some people off. Can I pet the doggo? Oh, you can't pet the doggo. No petting the doggo. Yeah, well, I was trying. I was thinking, like, I've seen. Uh, you know what? World of Warcraft has been doing my head in. I've seen it constantly on Twitter. Like, and man, I don't know. You know, I don't know. I'm not. I don't know if I'm feeling it. So I thought, you know what? If everyone else is playing a retro game, I'm going to play a retro game. Why not? Yeah, I've got doggo pitch there. I'm going to move the camera. So you guys can actually see what I'm doing a little bit better. Ugh. Or maybe not. Maybe. Mix has changed something and it's really annoying. I can't edit it like I used to. How do I get to the edit screen again? Scenes, yeah, we want that one. Giveaway, live actions, editor, cloudbot, store, studio, get help. All right, we'll leave it. But we've got Doggo's health in the corner. Mm. Oh, one more thing, one more thing, one more thing, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna get going. I haven't got my chat up for all the other chats, so they want to be like, why are you ignoring us? Don't ignore us, man. So let me get that open quick. Apologies, Twitch chat, if you're there, say hello again. I can see you all now. I can see everything now. So what's everyone doing? So yeah, a bit of a chill stream. A bit of a chill stream. We'll see what's going on. Oh. Yeah, we've got some. Okay, so it's pretty easy. Okay, getting used to it. Oh, loads of new games. Last Oasis is probably going to be the big one. Then we've got Citadels Forged with Fire in October. And then we've got in Ark, obviously, coming up for DLC. Um, and then in January, we've got Savage Planet, Journey to the Savage Planet. That's looking pretty sweet. Okay, okay, I'm getting used to it a little bit now. Whoa! My low. Right, my mana's low, so how do I just do a normal attack? Must be a way that I'm not doing something. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look in the settings. Let's look in the settings. Move, move. There you go. Maybe that's fixed it now. No, I'm still doing my like normal attack. And I'll do like a, a, a switch attack. Let's try that again. 
Cast active spell, yeah. Attack only valid targets, yeah. Arcane weapon swap, W, active skill swap. Active. Oh man, there's a lot of things going on here. Is there not just like a normal one? Is that it? I've just got to use me, me, me thingy. Okay, alright, alright, alright. I swear you used to be able to use like two or three attacks at the same sort of time. There you go. Oh, so we used a potion there. Mana potion. Cool. Right, let's go. Ever played ESO? Yeah, I did, zombie. I actually got some success with a few guides back in the day before I covered Ark. A couple of them videos that I did, tutorials on, on it when it came to console, were the first videos to get me like a good few thousand views. I think my uh, guide to... I've forgotten it all now. But one of my guides to uh, how to slot magic into stuff or how to slot um, jewels and things into your uh, weapons that was like one of the most popular videos for ages Outer World maybe you know what I ain't gonna lie I weren't that much of a big fan of the Fallout series and I know it's kind of uh, it's it's meant to have more vibes of um, it's gonna it's supposed to be better um, this is gonna be an issue if I've got all this mana all the time running out I'm, I'm, I'm keep holding WSD. I don't really do anything. I just realised I don't need to keep pressing it. I still feel like there's a button missing. Move, move, attack. Okay, so maybe I just got to be close. Okay, there we go. All right, I got it. Let's right. We just got to be close to a bad guy, and then I'll, I'll start attacking. You, uh, maybe. Recruit? Uh, you saved my life, all these Ratlins had my number for sure. Ratlins! Why bad rats always bad guys? Um, physical armor? Yeah, let's have that. So we choose my late loot. I've got fame points. It's got a little British Bulldog. Do you see my little dog i got as well? You a new recruit? State your business. Look at the little doggo. Look at the little doggo. Shadow Kid plays because... What do you so why are you watching my stream, Shadow? What game do you watch me for? Cause if it's Art, Cohen and Daisy, if I'm not playing them games, then no one really watches. I don't understand why you don't get that. Cause uh I think pretty much even the biggest streamers, when they play something different, they don't get as many people watching them. Not that it matters. It's quite rude to jump into a stream and start moaning about uh, how often someone's actually got viewers. Don't you know? There we go. I've worked it out. We've just got to get close to them. Cheers, Frosty. Appreciate it, mate. Lovely lady. Good evening. When are we getting rust? Don't know, Ben. Not too sure, mate. If I, if I knew the answers, I would do a video on it. Because uh, that, that shit is is definitely... Uh, oh, damn. That's it. That's it. Right, I'm getting the hang of it now. I can just click on the bad guy and we'll do it that way. It's... So, okay. So, this is the other thing. It's not an MMO. It's a multiplayer game. But I was just... Because it was retro. I thought, yeah, let's trigger some World of Warcraft fans. Uh, but they have got Torchlight Frontiers coming out, which is an MMO. So, it's their new game. They've got the remake coming to consoles. And at the moment, they've got an alpha called Torchlight Frontiers, which is this. But yeah, in an MMO. I think it's going to be free to play as well. So, uh, it's definitely something to think about. Go and check out. Torchlight Frontiers. But honestly, I, it's one of my favourite games back in the day. I used to just love chilling on it. Ah! Quick, move out of the way of the fire. Go on, doggo. It will be, it should be on console, I think so, yeah. You could do that on PC. I, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to dig up some more information. I'm trying to get hold of a review copy right now. And once I get hold of a review copy, I'll be able to do one of my, you know, my videos. Everything you need to know about Torchlight. It may not be everyone's cup of tea, but... I'm sick of playing crap broken games like Daisy. It's time to start playing stuff that I actually enjoy a little bit more.
And eventually you get loads of different weapons, loads of upgrades, you get loads of armor points. Typical sort of RPG. I mean, these are big in business. I've lost count how many of these I've seen come out recently. They used to be quite a big business on, on Xbox 360 as well. They made like Lords of the Rings ones, Dungeons and Dragons ones. All this style, same style, like over the shoulder, looking down, top down sort of thing. Um, and then Pillars of Eternity and... Or is it Path of Exiles? Path of Exiles is the big popular one. The free to play one that pe people just love. Uh, I stopped literally... I, I wasn't feeding it. I, I, I thought I was hopefully going to be getting Skyrim. But it, it wasn't... It wasn't Skyrim. It was... Ah, get, Okay, there we go. Right. It was. Uh, it ended up being just an, uh, uh, a massively multiplayer game, a little bit too much like World of Warcraft for me. And for some reason, I just I didn't work feeling it. And then I think I got I got some success with something else. I can't remember what it was. It might have been Ark, you know, because I remember ESO came out in like September time on console. I waited until then, and then I tried a bunch of different games. I was doing Destiny. I was enjoying Destiny. I did some cheese guides. They were popular. And then Ark came out on Christmas. And that was it. I started covering Ark on Xbox. Twitch is whacked out for you. Oh, I'm sorry, Ducting. What are you up to, Zombie Cartman? Yeah, you've been playing a lot of games. You are you still on Daisy Grind? Did you playing that one? But yeah, I'm I'm really tired of playing games that are broken. I am setting up an Arc PC server though tomorrow, which I'm looking forward to. We're gonna add it a bit more role play like. We're gonna add like um some stuff like uh Can we go in there? No. Um We're gonna add like Survival Plus, make it like quite quite grindy, quite like uh, medieval style themed. Is that a chest I can open? There you go. Okay, you know what I should be doing? We should be equipping some of this stuff. I'm sure I can. Shift click to transfer. Boots, empty stuff. What is it? It's a vermintin stub. Okay, let's put that on then. Oh, it's a pet. It's from a pet. I had, to get, I had to get my pet. Switch pet to be aggressive, to be defensive. Okay, that's cool. How do I add uh, my pet panel. Oh, there we go, pet panel. There we go. Put something on the doggo. Light pants. Healthy light pants. Light pants, light pants. Can I get rid of these? Is there a way to get rid of them? Oh, can I sell them? Maybe I can sell them. I'll keep hold of them for now. A buckler shield. Okay, have I got a shield? Yeah, let's put the buckler shield on. Although I think that means, yeah, you can't have your weapon. Okay, so we won't do that just yet. Alright, we're getting there. Oh, we've got a few potions. Waypoint. Create a, a portal. Identify. Right stick, then left stick for on an unidentified item. That's right, you used to be able to do that. Things in chests. Okay, spells. Okay, we're getting the hangs of it now. We're getting the hangs of it. And what's that one? Arcane statistics. So this is upgrades and stuff. Right hand weapon, left hand weapon, stats. There's loads here. It's like, if you love this sort of shit, there's loads. That's pretty easy as well. Strength. You know what? We'll go a little bit of strength. Dexterity is critical strikes, dodge and fumble. Focus is elemental damage and mana. Yeah, if we're a mage, we're going to go heavy on mana. And vitality as well. I mean, I've got loads of points. I had loads of points there. Okay, cool. So I might have been high enough level to access that chest if I'd leveled up. Minecraft survival. Nice. Yeah, well that's it. A game's like that. That's why I always say to like you people that want to do YouTube. Find a game that, that needs a lot of help with. If you're not 
can find something really interesting. Like, there's too many people doing Let's Plays. You've got to really stand out to do a Let's Play, something really unique. But guides and tutorials are always a great What's way to, to get views and get noticed. Talk the effort. State your business. You a new recruit? Okay, so we're, we're back at this spot here. Everyone's like all brown bread and injured and stuff. I'll speak to this dude. Got like shamans and shizzle. So they're all been beaten up in the war. The art's pretty good. I mean, this is a seven year old game. Reminds me of Dauntless. Anyone else? Shared stash, you can share that with people or different characters, I think, back in the day. I remember being gutted. I, I got through the whole first game and um, I thought I was going to get all the points, all the achievos for it and stuff. But it. Um, Have we met? They added, like, you had to complete it again on hard mode. And I was just like, oh man, I ain't got time for this. Big health potion, resistance, fire resistance, poison. So, pretty common garden stuff. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll have another, we'll have a couple more mana potions. It's probably always a good idea to have a few. Uh, maybe I can sell my stuff to her. Will you sell my stuff? Can I sell my stuff to you? Yeah, we'll do it like that. Yeah, sell all. Cool. You know what, we'll get rid of the shield as well. Bosh. Cool. Sold. Oh, there's a question mark. Let's go. There's a question mark. Is it up here? Yeah, the, hello. I thank you for your warning, but it has arrived too late. This alchemist has already come and gone, and it was all I could do to prevent him from entering the enclave. As it was, many Estalians were injured, and since the confrontation, several more have become ill. We are not sure what is causing it. After his assault failed here, the alchemist carried on southward toward the temple steps. Commander Vale, Commander Vale believes... Right, so we're going to follow this guy to the Vale. I picked up a new staff. And basically we're investigating this monster that broke out that defeated all the previous heroes. That's generally what we're doing. This is like the hub town. So in the original Torchlight, you would just keep going in dungeons. It would just go down and down and down and down. You'd have portals that would unlock. That would take you back up to town to buy, sell stuff, change your gear. <coughs> Ooh. I'll do that one. You have a new quest. I've got a new quest. State your business. Right, I think we can get out of here. Let's go. Daisy did the wipe when I was on and wiped my clan as well. Oh rip. You just get here? Yeah, Daisy's trash, mate. Go on. It's like a ghost there. Yeah? Light boots. Okay. It was just hidden. Because they're blue. So these are these are like a new enemy, I swear. Cause we had like goblins before, now we've got like these skeleton dudes. Tell you a game I'm really looking forward to, like the remix is coming out. Medieval! Anyone remember that one back in the day on the PlayStation? That's got the remaster coming, I think in October time as well. So I'm, I'm feeling that. Go on, mate. Smashed it. Smashed it. Getting a little bit lost. There's loads of places to go. Let's go this way. What other games are you guys looking forward to? What's the biggest things for you lot? Safe travels. It's my duty to tend to undead, but they're angry and have risen from their tombs. The tranquil sense should calm them once again, but they attack me in during struggle. I dropped it. Can we help me get it back? Okay. Safe travels. All right, cool. So where's this gauntlet then? There you go. You retrieved the tranquil sensor. Thank you. So I can have the venomous ice wands, the cloven shoulders, or the cinch. You know what, we'll have some armour. Let's take the armour. And we'll, we'll, we'll take a look at the armour as well. 
There you go. I'll space button for the armor. Okay. And I've still got more. Have I got more points? No, I've used all my points. Level 8. Oh, damn. What level am I? I'm level 3. Oh, I've got some, some way to go yet. Where's, uh... Armor? Did I not just get some armor from him? I've equipped it already. Yeah, I have. It's gone. It's gone to my chest already. Let's go zoom in a little bit. Huh. And Gears Five. Yeah, Gears Five. Oh, I've been. I tried. I'm trying to get hold of a review copy. That's out on the fifth. No, it's out on the tenth. But on the sixth, for everyone that's on Games Pass or has pre-ordered it. And I've tried to get an older review copy. I probably won't get it. But if I do, I'll definitely be streaming it. It's meant to be good. I've heard it's like open world. They've gone all open world. Well, not completely open world. But the levels are big. And there's like multiple choice. And you do side quests. And it sounds a bit like more RPG-like. And so far, what people have said, it is pretty good. It hasn't ruined it. Because you know sometimes they like... Some people are unhappy, like Assassin's Creed has gone quite roleplay like, RPG like. I've gained a level. I've gained a level. Shame you can't rotate the camera. That's the only thing I've got an issue with this game. The makers of this game actually went out of business. They released, um, after Torchlight 2, they worked on a game called Hob, which was a nice sort of puzzle game. No one bought it. And uh, oh, oh, it's bad. It's a bad chest. It's a mimic. I don't know. Is there a way to switch things around? Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, we can use them too. But yeah, they went out of business. And so someone just bought the rights to the game. I've gained a level as well, didn't it? It's a game level. Uh, let's, I'm just going to keep going up in vitality. Going to really boost up my vitality. Gosh, arm bonus. And we'll, we'll do keep doing magic as well. Because that's who I am. I'm a mage. I was a mage last time in the first one. Lovely lady. Matt, hello, mate. So, uh, that's the only thing I need like a I need my pet to start gathering stuff. I need your help. Oh. You must be the human the other Asterians are speaking of. I'm glad to have met you. I've been sent on a quest by Grand Regent Eldran to recover the scroll of Anom Ilek, stored vault corrupted crypt. Get past them. Okay, so this guy. We'll do it then. Picking up all these missions now. Okay, this guy. Ozzy Beggar! Ah, oh, sorry, I thought you said something. How are you doing, lovely lady? You still playing Ark? You trying any new games lately? I've got a raffle prize as well. Make sure if you've got PC and you want to win a copy of Ancestors to Humankind Odyssey, that chimp game. I'm doing it tomorrow. Is my little dog poisoned? Oh, he's like hitting ice attacks there. That's pretty cool. Uh. I'm still getting a bit used to uh, like attacking and moving in the same direction. It's really weird. It's like a twin stick shooter. I wish I really do wish they had controller support. That'd be really cool. Can I unlock this? Oh shit! No. Doggo saved me there, I think. Just getting a bit hectic now. Did I even open that chest? There we go, let's open it all up, let's take it. <coughs> oh, Witcher 3, yeah, oh, you know what, Ozzy Becker, I might start playing that too, eventually. Because I, I want to get ready for the Netflix show. 
I mean, I know it's not based on the game, but I still fancy playing it. Like, I thought we could have, we could talk about it. I might even do start with some vlogs, like Angry Joe style. I've never played the Witcher past the uh, the Griffin boss, really. I've run around a little bit, but I didn't go too much. Okay, right, so I've just explored all these areas, and it's pretty much all the same area. Let's go. There we go. We're getting used to it now. Yeah, I'm, I've been tapping stuff. I don't need to tap. I can just hold, run down. It's like, it's a fairly easy game. Oh. Leave my dog alone. Bosh. What might be? Oh. Oh. What is that? Oh, I just killed the rat. Why have rats always got to be bad guys? What is that? I want to know what that is. I'm a fool. Peace who can't handle games, not yet. Jurek the Socketeer. Ah, oh, yes, this was good. This is where like customization comes in. You can like customize and, and make your. Um, like your armor can all have different slots, all pretty bog standard stuff. But seven years ago, a lot of this was an acquired taste. Some people didn't really like this stuff. Um, so yeah, it's definitely one of them. I think I think we better have a potion. Okay, they're dead. Risk of rain two is good. Is the console version? It is at the moment, but PC will get the updates first. Bit cheeky, really, that Risk of Rain has come out as a full game when it's still in early access on PC. But they seem a pretty solid development team. And they've been updating that game pretty well on PC. So I've got no fears about it being like a seven days to die situation where the content never comes out. Um, what was I meant to do? Is he going to give me something? Adjust, add sockets. Okay, so I've got loads of stuff now. Inert ones. I still can't use some of this stuff because I'm only level 3. Inert staff, inert staff. I'm going to try it just for the lulls. Oh, maybe not. 1700. Yeah, won't be doing that. I feel like I've come in here way too early, obviously. I can't afford anything. So, suck it. Another game, right? I don't know if, like, obviously people don't think the same as me about games, but I do like all games. It doesn't have to be ultra realistic or sort of more adult themes. I could play like Minecraft or Terraria. There's a game called uh, Cube World that came out again. Another one from years ago. Not as old as this. Oh shit. Go on, get him. Um, and they released a video yesterday. This developer basically made this game just after Minecraft came out. And everyone was going mad for it, called Cube World, right? And um, he wasn't coping very well, though, with like the attention that it was getting. And he kind of just stopped. He, he wasn't really a game developer. It was someone, him and his wife, or just a two-man team. And people bought this game, like loads of people. It blew up on YouTube for a little while. And nothing really come of it. Um, and he stopped updating the game, stopped talking about stuff. He took it off sale, so he couldn't buy it on sale anymore. And it gained, like, cult status. And so for years, there hasn't been an update to the game. He only ever had, like, two updates, even though he was saying he was going to add all sorts. And uh, he come out with, like, a big gameplay video yesterday. So everyone's, like, super excited. So I'm going to cover that. It's, like, a little bit like Trove. In fact, I think Trove was pretty much based heavily on it. Stardew Valley, yeah, that's it, zombie. You want something just chill sometimes, didn't you? I like, um, it's a bit hard and grindy, um, but a bit more adult. Uh, it's like I've got a few more adult themes. Um, Graveyard Keeper, that's a pretty cool one. I love Forager at the moment. Forager's my go-to game. I stayed up to like 5 o'clock in the morning the other day playing that. They've just got a new update on the uh, beta branch combat update, which is looking pretty good. That Undermine game that I tried the other day was pretty cool as well. Again, not everyone's a cup of tea, but I liked it. 
you know what, I'm still going to go up. Vitality is like the one. I'll make myself basically a tank. A tank mage. Oh. Nothing else here? Okay. Right, so yeah, we are, I've kind of been pissing about a bit. We've got, we've got to jump down. We've got to find a way down. Is it this way? Yeah, it's like a little maze. See that little mini maze, mini map up the top. Oh, oh man, that, that beat me up, that dude. Oh, chest. You know what, let's have a, let's have a quick ganders. And what stuff we've got going on. Requires level 6 or focus 27. Am I not right? Oh, level 5. I'm getting closer. What's that one? Requires level 2. Walking staff. Oh, it's, well, it's definitely better than the one I've got now. In that staff, walking staff. There you go, okay, I've equipped it now. Got Lumber Axe, Blood Ember, Rare Socket Ball. Oh, you know what, I might put that on something then. Yes, yeah, I'm going to be 15 more health. Let's put it on the, uh, that one. No? Can I put it on green stuff? Oh, there you go, I've put it on that socket, cool. And I've got the shoes, light boots, Quasil Free, Set Ghastly. There we go. Yeah, we're upgrading our stuff. Got a bow, nice. Hand cannon, two-handed. It's all like two-handed stuff. Light jacket. Oh, they both do the exactly the same thing, so not too fast about that. Skills. Oh, okay, yeah, so you get extra skills. Yeah, let's have that. And we'll unlock some more soon. So I've got storm skill. That one and that one. Yeah, we'll do the magma one. That's right. How do you switch spells? I forgot you can switch spells. So we can switch that to that. And then I don't know how to uh, activate the second spell. might be worth trying to work out exactly how to do the second spell. Settings. Controls. Cast active skill. Right mouse. Move attack. Left max. Hold. Is there a way to skill menu? Weapon swap. W. Active skill swap. Tab. Okay. Tab. Tab. Yeah. Oh, nice. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, we're getting the hangs of it. We're getting the hangs of it. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. A bit of crowd control. A bit of crowd control. Oh dear, he's been, this guy has uh, tweeting at me and all sorts today. Alex, you literally have only ever commented on one video. And that was to be a little cuntish troll today. And then tweeted at me, yet supposedly I was your favourite YouTuber. You've never commented on any of my other videos. You're a sad little motherfucker, mate. Bye bye, Alexander. See you later, shit lord. Bye bye, mate. Anyway, let's not focus on the tiny little children with limp dicks. Ooh.
Right, that's where we've got to get to, down there. I'm basically fight, fighting a boss. Ah, oh, yeah. So, I like that little that bolt there we've got going on. Because it goes behind as well. Oh, man. My mana is low. Your mana is low. Okay, we'll have another one. I think this one's a bit more expensive, though. Nice. What's that? Spontoon. What's a spontoon? Have we got any levels yet? No, no extra levels yet. So yeah, see if he's good. What do you think about Atlas Zombie? Have you ever tried that one? On PC, or you'd be waiting till it hits console on Xbox and stuff? I've got loads of weapons here. I've got so much to sell now, this is good. Okay, that's the boss fight. No, maybe it's not a boss fight. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Whoa. Shit. That was like... Can't get these guys yet. Piss off. There we are. We've got all that stuff. We got it all there. Love and see that. But yeah, Atlas, you thought about that one? How do you think that's going to do on the console crowds? No, get out of the way, Doggo. Get out of the way. He's getting burnt by that stuff. My mana is low. Not enough mana. Yeah, same problem with this spell. It is quite expensive. I might um, switch back over to the other one. Oh, Doggo is like getting ruined by the uh, slimes. Doggo is like proper hurt. Is there a way to heal the doggo? I might switch into. Your pet has departed. No, oh, no. Oh, so what you can do is you can send your pet back to your uh, shops, and he basically goes and sells anything you've got on you. So if you have too much gear, too many items, yeah, you can do that. Yeah, let's recall the pet. I want to see if I can. Healing. I think you've got to put potions um, in inside him, like separately. Maybe. Oh, he's nearly full health now. Anyway. Oh, no, no, I was saying, like, you said that you've been playing Sea of Thieves. So I was just thinking, like, how's that that's going to perform? Because to me, Sea of Thieves is, like, the accessible version of Atlas. Runs a lot better, obviously. And now it's had some time, it seems to have a lot more content and stuff, so people are happy. But do you think Atlas will be, like, a, a decent pirate game on Xbox? Or do you play it on Windows 10? Yeah, you could spend ages exploring all these places, these zones. Okay, right, here we go. We're going. Right, now we can go up or we can go up. There we go. Sweet. I 
I can see this game really take. I don't like. It's not been that much. Like I, I tried. It took me like half an hour to find a review key email to try and get a review copy for console. Otherwise, I'll just buy it. But I was trying to get one ahead of its release. Um, I could see this taking off on console. I just feel like a lot of these games are really popular at the moment with more mature audiences, like Path of Exiles and stuff. And um, yeah, it's launching on Xbox, PlayStation, Switch. I think it's going to be a really good game to play on the old uh, the Switch. So I'm about on the Switch. It's coming on the uh, the third, mate. Tuesday. It's crazy, it makes me feel really old that it's only seven years ago, but to me, Torchlight feels relevant still. But I was thinking today, looking around, I looked up Twitch, no one is playing this game on Twitch, like no one. I am the only streamer on Twitch right now playing this game. And, uh, you know, the interest in it isn't there. But this, this is a, it's got a fantastic rating on Steam. Uh, Torchlight 2. It, like I said, it was considered to be better than Diablo 3 for a long time. I like there's a nice variety of enemies as well. No. You know what? Let's get back. Oh, is this the bad guy? This might be the actual the, the dude. I think it is, you know. Yeah, we did it. We got 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 it. That was the guy. You've completed the quest. Receive your word. Speak to the individual that gave you the quest. Yeah, okay. You can speed things up using the waypoint to bring directly to town. Okay, yeah. So we might do that in a minute. A lot. Of, so that was a big point of this. A lot of these uh, levels and stuff, you would end up carrying on. No, stop fighting the zombies. Go away. Um, you'd kill a boss, and then there'd be another dungeon path that took you down, and you could just keep exploring, exploring these dungeons, and you always went down and down and down. It was like meant to be like a, in a, a mine. I think they've changed the gameplay, made it seem a bit more all over the world now. So I'm interested in the Frontiers. I've heard a, a few bad things about it. The, they've got an alpha running at the moment, which is like Torchlight 2 is the sequel, co-op, whatever, console come in. Then they've got this Frontiers game, which is an MMO. So it's going to be like lots of players running around like this together. Um, I haven't heard too many good things about it. I haven't. But... I'm hope hopeful that's just, just maybe some sort of people, I don't know. Can we jump down here? Yay! Someone else is excited about Torchlight. Someone knows. War Duck, thank you, mate. I feel, you know where you're like mad? You're, or you feel really old that you're talking about a game that no one else knows, no one's ever seen or played? But yeah, I'm super excited, mate. I mean, I know I've got it on PC, but as you can tell, I'm not a very good PC player. I'm not used to controls and stuff. So I definitely prefer having it on a console. And I really am feeling like, oh, Switch is, Switch is going to be the way to play it. <clears throat> yeah, so I don't really need to be gathering all this stuff up now. Like, I've got everything I can get, really. But, that's like I said, it's one of the things that you end up just doing. Oh, there's a portal there as well. Maybe that'll take me. Oh, trap. Okay, we're all healed up. Let's, uh, let's have a little nose at me stats and stuff. I'm still going to go Vitality. Just beasting up my Vitality. I guess I should put a bit more strength. Critical strikes a little bit. And dexterity could, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll try and balance it a little bit. I'm like a war mage, a tank mage. Easy one for you. I know, mate. I know. I, I, I ain't gonna lie. I was slightly trolling a little bit, mainly because I've just seen my Twitter feed awash with people talking about World of Warcraft. I could not be less interested. 
I've never been a, a fan and that game looks like people okay so some people probably watching this going Jay this ain't the one mate this game's old it's it's dopey looking or it's cartoonish I look at World of Warcraft and say the same I'm like that ain't the one man that game looks old it's dopey looking so I thought you know what we'll, we'll do it I'm playing a retro game everyone's loving the retro we'll call it this instead of Diablo Thank you, Demonic. Appreciate it. Thank you for also watching something that isn't ARK. Cheers for the support, bro. What does everyone think of Ancestors? Like, I feel like I missed the boat on that. I should have got, tried getting hold of a copy. Everyone sort of beat me to it with the guides and gameplay. Tag Back TV's getting hundreds of thousands of views with it. And it's a good game. It does get a bit repetitive, though. That's kind of why I've stopped playing it as much for now. Golden key. What does a golden key do? I still didn't do that either. I didn't actually go through the rest of the stats. Look how much loot we've got. This is like loot. So the idea of loot and getting different stuff. Diablo obviously inspired a lot of that. So you think about like Borderlands, Diablo got a lot of that credit for making them games come up with RNG loot where you get different loot drops. Torchlight took that and ran with it as well. So all these games give all these sort of different uh, aspects. Which I like. There you go. So I've socketed some stuff. And wand range. So I've got... Now I've added fire, flame, ember spec. Chaos, ember spec. That's cool. That's cool. You know what? I'm going to start recording. Seems cool, but I don't care for it. I've never played... Oh, uh, well. Overlord, hello, mate. Did I say hello to you when you came in? I, um... I've got to say, yeah, it's one of the games that I've just never really been into. I, I don't know why. I just thought, oh, I still think, like, literally, I said it on Twitter the other day. I see someone talking about WoW. I instantly go, what a nerd. Play a proper game. Which is bad, really. I should be probably giving it uh, more of a chance. So that one's, uh... Walking Staff, Walking Staff. Walking staff. Okay. Got a gun here as well. I might just put a gun on just for lulls. So there's there's slot two. Right hand weapon. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So there we go. Yeah, let's put a shotgun on. Let's see what this is about. Shotgun. Healthy like pants. Any of these pants better? No, they're all like jank. 45 cloth gloves. That looks alright though. 45 cloth gloves. That's a blue one. Mystical sunbeam. Right click to equip. There we go. Okay, we'll do it like that. It's a colour grading. Blue's better than green. All that sort of stuff. Mysterious. Ooh, I've got to identify it. So yeah, so you've got to scroll. You get like gear and you've got to use scrolls to identify it to basically see what level it is. Grimy work gloves. Oh, you know what? We'll have it. Oh, no, I've got to be level 8. Rip. Alright. Alright. I've got a few different things going on there. And you can just leave that on screen. That's another thing as well. People love their menus and stuff. You can just leave it all. But we won't, we won't leave it all. Can I resize this a little bit? I can zoom in a little bit. I bet there's a button for that. So that's Miami. Can I put a waypoint down? I've forgotten if there's a waypoint. Okay. Switch pet to aggressive. Yeah, no, what we'll do that now. Now he's he's taking a beat a little bit. I got the scroll. Alright, so I've got lots of new items. Cool. Oh, well, I've got to choose which one I want. So I've got the Ice Surge Witch Wand, the Charged Tribal Staff. Wow, that does 79 damage. That one does 60 damage. That's pretty quick. The thing to watch out for is like how much element it does it uses up. 
one man and stolen. That's a pretty good one if you get um, mana from them as well. Oh, she's got her boobies out. What's that about? And ice armored spark tag. Oh, you know what? That's the most expensive thing. I'm gonna have that. We're gonna we're gonna give it to the doggo. Can't believe you can like put armor in the doggo, but you can't um. You can't. What should we call it? Shopping list. Oh, so you can just buy stuff from town. That's pretty cool. So you can send... That's pretty... So that's good. Yeah, I like that. See? It's all these things you can do. Man, I don't know how console is going to do this. I'm trying to think about the buttons. I'm trying to remember how um, Torchlight did it. The first one. It was just lots of LBs and, and stuff. I'm pretty sure. Right. I'm trying to work out how to give him that gear that I've got. I want to equip the doggo. There we go. That's how we do it. So, put that one there. There we go. He's got some armor now. I still want to give him a potion. Still think I'll need to. Pet consumables. How do you, like, only take half? That's what I was trying to think of. Like, is there a way just to take half? I don't want to give you all the potions. Uh, split. C. Tab. Control. No. X. H. T. No. Alright. Maybe it's not like that. Maybe he doesn't take potions. Has he got any levels as well? He's got 50 mana there. Can he go up higher? Pet spells. Pet equipment. Okay. Alright. Well, I can get him to hold stuff soon. Right. That's one quest done. Let's go for the next one. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Like, so, ESO, free to play now? No, you've still got to pay, like, £10. It's ch cheap to buy the base game. And then you've got to buy the season packs now. And then they offer microtransactions on top. That is bullshit. But World of Warcraft, I think a subscription service is probably outdated. Yeah, it should be, like, lots. No one else is ever going to do a subscription. It's all got to be free to play now with, with cosmetic microtransactions and stuff. But I could see a way how some people would prefer it. Mate, I'm owning, absolutely owning the uh, bad guys. I'm feeling pretty powerful at the moment. Right, let's go this way. Not trying my shotgun yet. State your business. All right, mate. Calm down. State your business. Right, I'm here. Eve Online, if you spent time playing, you could earn in-game cash. Oh, is that right, Matt? Oh, shit. Oh, nice. Oh, I'm feeling the shotgun. Takes a bit of a while to get going, though. Yeah, feeling it. Well, last thing. I didn't share anything on Twitter. I don't think I did. Let's get some more people on here. Let's do it. Big shout out if you are following me on Mixer as well. Thank you. I'm fairly new to Mixer. Much more uh, content usually on um, YouTube. I guess I should open it up, really. Take a look. And I guess I should really take a little look at uh, Twitch as well. Five people on Twitch! Woohoo! Get in the five the five crowd. Oh, it's signed me into the wrong one. Lock out that one.
but yeah, all right. Thank, appreciate it. Thank you guys. Um, let's carry on. Let's carry on. Dan for twenty. Yo. Final Fantasy still does subscriptions. That's another one I wanted to get into a little bit because uh, I remember playing the trial of it once, and yeah, I think I got a free month subscription of it, and that was something I just didn't, I weren't feeling. So that's the waypoint that's going to take us home. You know what? We should maybe go back. I don't know what that timer does. Oh, it's like a special charge, like a special ability. So when it's fully charged up, I get like extra uh, hits and stuff. You know what? Let's go. Yeah, let's go back to base. Um, yeah. Because I want to go and sell all that gear that we just got. <coughs> What's your business here? So this guy wants me to get some war beasts to use the stock troops. They want to find out how to get the armor. The stern ball. Okay. Alright, we'll take it. You end up just doing this. What's your business here? Just taking like a billion billion uh, quests. Oh, that's good. Who's this guy? Did you need something? Skill reset. Oh, okay. Why would you reset a skill? Oh, maybe you're really sick of that weapon. May I assist you? Right, yes you may. I'm going to sell all my junk. Is there a quick way to sell all my junk? Organise inventory. There we go. So I've got like literally three adept ones. What am I wearing now? Healthy light ones. So that gives two physical armour. Oh. See? I feel like it should do it automatically. But I will. Shift click to sell. Oh, so, okay. I'm really hopeful I'm not... Um, Getting rid of stuff that shouldn't be here. Yeah, that was right. We should have them for sure. Yeah, we'll get rid of all this hand cannon business. I don't need these cleavers, notched axed, full swords, truncheon. Might keep the spontoon. I've got three staffs here, don't need all three staffs. A green, I've got blue on. So it's got to be better. Shoes wise. I quite like the music in this as well. Superior light bridges, now good at them. Requires level 8 grimy work gloves. We might keep them. Yeah, we'll get rid of that one. We'll get rid of that one. I'll get rid of like pretty much everything that's just not that great. A uh, healthy ringed Aventail. Is that better than what I've got? Yes, it is. Anything else better than what I got? 42. Ah, oh, you know what? I might. It's always a good idea to have something that doesn't use mana up as much. I might take that over the shotgun. Requires level 7. I'm pretty sure I'm level 7 now. I thought I was. No, I'm not. I'm nearly there. I'm nearly at level 7. I am at your service. I'm gonna buy some mana potions. We've only got two. Yeah, there we go. We'll have a couple of them. Potion. Oh man, they're expensive. I've got loads of coin each though. Identify scroll. Yeah, we'll have a couple of them. Yeah, I won't, I won't do too much. We'll have just that. We'll have just that at the moment. Well, Mina, hello, sir. Oh, did you? That's cool. See, that's one good thing, I guess. Maybe I should really uh, connect my my Jade Plays Games account, which I've got like, I don't know, 800 people following me on, as opposed to my Jammy Jade account, and then I might get more viewers. That's pretty cool though, I've been thinking about that. Oh, maybe I should just change my, um, use my, yeah, my other account more. But yeah, Mixers, I, I'm still not used to it. I've not really looked into it. I, I don't really, I haven't added my profile and stuff, but I will, for sure, so. Tinya, oh, she's got loads of stuff I can buy. 
weapons for sales. She just sells dog stuff as well. Okay, we won't buy anything. I'm going to be a cheapskate and just not buy anything just yet. And I can put stuff away. You know what? I'm going to put... Why is that one away? Because it's level 7. I'm not level 7 yet. Brutal Poison Wand. Fiery Walking Staff. Oh, we've got two there. I want to put that. Organised Moving Tree a little bit better. Yeah, that's it. Cool, 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 cool. I think so, yeah. So, it's, uh, no, power. power. Yeah, rare and power. So, you know, the typical green, blue, yellow. I think that's it. I don't know if it goes any other colours. Maybe there's a purple. Red means that you can't use it at the moment, I don't think. Shotgun's alright. And I'm building up my stamina, that's pretty cool. I want to see just like what happens then. There we go. So I could just use that without draining any more mana. Nice, nice, nice. But gotta be careful when it starts draining my mana. Okay, that's worth knowing though. I might start building up my shotgun attack a little bit more because that seems to build it up a little yes. bit quicker. You eyes a bit clear, but hands was high resin switch, believe. Oh, nice for me now. Oh, right, I might try it. Yeah, No Man's Sky. I want to love that game so much. I talk about it being a good game now so much. But something just goes on. I, I start playing it, and I'm not a big fan of the camera angle, the third person view. I, I usually prefer that, but it just seems like a bit off. And then I kind of just feel like it's a bit pointless. Like I, I think I've got to play it proper in survival mode. Um, I have recorded. I forgot I've even got it. I've got like two hours worth of No Man's Sky Let's Play footage. That I recorded last week. I just haven't had time to edit it and do something with it. I thought I was going to save it for when I'm on holiday. Just in case I need something emergency. Oh man, I could be Wolverine. I think Torchlight's going to go well. I think people are going to instantly recognise, oh shit, yeah, this is just like Fortnite with the rarities and Dauntless and putting slots in. Um, It's probably not worth... You can get skills that increase your barter skills so that... um. You can take, it costs less money, I think. Or you used to be able to. But yeah, it's still just a bit too, I don't know. Like I said, I wasn't, after a while I was like, I feel I'm done, you know. I think I'm done playing this. What I do want to do is see other people's creations. Like the light boxes, Matt, I, I don't know if you can tell me. But on PC they said they added stuff that was missing out of the construction table. Because everyone couldn't buy the light boxes. You can get them in creative mode, but you can't get them out of creative mode. I thought maybe I can do something cool. So when you land your ship, the light boxes come on and stuff. All right, mate. Oh, I love these sweets. They're so sugary, though. Right. I've pissed about here enough. Be on my way soon. If the alchemist is attacking guardians, he I must be on my way. Let's go.
it should be um, Wicked Knight. This game is... Um, $20. $16.95 on Xbox in UK. Pounds. But, so I imagine that's about $20 everywhere else. PlayStation Switch and the Xbox. Well, I guess we should really maybe go towards the, the map. I kind of forgot where, what I was meant to be doing. Half of the honor dead. Is that what I was meant to be doing? Protect the governor. Discover the Wellspring Temple and the Temple Steps. Okay, no, that's what we've got to do. Yeah. Well, didn't they do that with Mina with um, Judgment with the classes? I'm sure Judgment had the classes, and then they didn't they keep it? I thought they had that for Gears 4, too. What is that? Oh, it's three cave trolls. It's like Lord of the Rings. But it's a good feeling of, like, exploration. Finding all sorts. What's this? Needs a gem. Oh, they're bears. I've got werewolves. That guy's pretty big. Oh, shit. Okay. I don't have enough money. That's it. There you go, I had the soup eventually. Oh! Smacked him, I didn't even, I wasn't even watching. Weird that it sent me all that way just to open up three chests and come out again. running out there. Why is the mana so slow? And where's my other weapon? Where's the shotgun gone hide? Scout gun? Yes, yeah, there. Okay, maybe I was just not doing something right.
Oh shit. Go on, speak. Nice. I've been away this area already. Felt like that sort of something I could pick up, but obviously not. Torchlight. Torch T cubes are gonna D3 is shit and Lisa Grim Dawn rode off to the sunset. Ghost. What are you talking about? What games are you talking about? TQ? Am I just being stupid? D3 is Destiny 3 and Grim. Are these the games that you're you're upset about? That you want to see come out? Oh, I can't go that way. Okay. Rip. Where do I go then? This way? Should really try and see if I can survey like these bad guys and see if they uh, like are more susceptible to a certain kind. Oh, I can fish! Got to wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. You caught a jackal bass. Nice. Yeah, I remember this now. So you give your fish to your pets, and your pet changes into stuff sometimes. Oh no, I was too early. It was too early. Too early. No, it was too early. Rip. I'm doing it again. Too early. Come on. Just gotta wait. There we go. Tinder tag. Let's fish one more time. Nice. I'm gonna I'm gonna raid this because I'm I'm sure they're really good for your pet. I remember transforming my pet a bunch of times. He changed into like imps and demons and all sorts. And I was quite upset he never could change back for some reason. I couldn't ever find anything to change him back to what he originally was. That's it. So now if I take a look in the inventory. I think it's pet ones. Pet food. Where's all that fish I just had? There you go. Transform into Jackabay. Oh, that's for me. Yeah, right click to feed fish to pet. So they're both Jackal Beasts. Okay. Oh. I might, I might get something there. You've got another one. Virulent. So what's he got on at the moment? Oh, mate, these are much better. Yeah, let's put that on him. Right, equipped, virulent, 11, 11, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll hide stuff inside him. I've got a ring, ooh, I've got rings. No, hang on, which one's better? Electrical ring. Can I have two rings? Yeah, we can. So, anything that's got slots, anything else that's good. No, it's a good idea actually to put stuff you know you're going to get rid of in your pet. And then you can send him off to go sell it all or... Um, yeah. Okay, right. Should we feed this? I'm going to feed this fish. We'll try it out. Ready? There you go. Oh, I don't know if I like him. He's turned into just like a wolfy looking dude now. There you go, 20, and we'll do 30. We'll keep him up a little bit. Yeah, I'm still just going to go up fight Tally. I'm still going to be a tank. That's what I'm feeling. It is. It's multiplayer online. Things up to four players. Although Nintendo Switch says something about it being... Um... Dorian, hello, mate. Uh... 
Local play. I don't really know how Switch online plays. I guess you, you can play without having an online Switch, but you can play with friends as well. You should be able to. But to be honest, I'm not 100% sure. I've been trying to get hold of a review key. Obviously, this is PC. But it is coming on console on Tuesday. Piss off, mate. That's the one. Use that. I like it. It's got like heat seeking stuff to it. I like that one. Yeah, now I'm getting confused because he's a little bit more grey looking. Oh shit. Oh, I've got unlimited mana. Any more bad guys? Oh, unlimited mana's gone now. Must pay attention to that. I'm thinking about top tips as well, because I'm going to do a tips video for this. I'll be like, right, you know, pay attention to that, because once it's filled up, you get to uh, get loads. The beast warrants. Okay, right, so we're on the quest. This is where the quest was. No, no, let's not leave. We're nearly there. We're nearly there for this quest. Let's do it. It's mad. There's loads of like little flashy bits going off everywhere and stuff. What's going on next what, Friday, MV? What are you looking forward to, Sam? No, oh, no, no. I don't want to leave. It's quite a small area, then. Let's go, we've got to try and work out how to... Uh, I guess we've just got to clear them up. Ah, I, that trap was like blatantly obvious and I still walked into it. They, a lot of these remind me of, like the cats in uh, Hema. Oh, there's loads of gold there. Right. Oh, here we go. Something's here. Something's big. Just got to keep remembering to pick everything up, which is definitely... I'm sure you can get stuff that picks it up for you. Or maybe not, actually. No, he's, he's dead. Barely saw that chest there. Oh, but we got it. We got the item. So that's what we need to complete this quest. Okay, so we can we can get out of these warrens now. We're just gonna head up top. Oh, whoa, all right. Ah. Oh, dog. Doggo. He went straight into it then, didn't he? Uh, well, uh, yeah. Smashing up them, uh, them points there. Speed. Anything else? That's good now. Ice Ember. Ooh, I might put that into something. Have I got anything to point into? No! I'm wearing all stuff that's got no sockets. That's the other thing as well, when you sell items, you've got to remember to take your so stuff out, like sockets. You know what that brutal one looks like it's doing better? I might... Walking staff. Yeah, let's try that. We'll put, we'll put that in there like that. Let's try this new brutal poison. Venom. Venom! 
Oh, we've got a new helmet. But it's not as good as that. Free. Free. Yeah, no. The Eye of Gumball. Ooh. It's almost the Eye of Gumball there. Okay, okay. We're doing alright. We're doing alright. Uh, spell inventory. Where's the uh, skills? There we go. Skills. So I can have Shocking Burst. That's what I used a lot of. I used to have the Gauntlets that would do lots of damage on um, Torchlight 1. Wind Chaos attacks using the one can result in bizarre random animal disturbances. These can also happen with a Magma Mace. Maybe. Prismic in ways when they strike with a chance of random effects. No. Fire ones. Elemental tuned. Oh, so everyone gets burnt if they're close by. I like this. I like that one. We'll go for that one, I think. And then Staff Mastery. Frozen Fate. When you kill an enemy, you have a chance to freeze up to four additional enemies within a seven meter radio. That one's good. Anything that helps you crowd control is really good in, in, in Torchlight. I've got one more point. One more point. You know what? I feel like we're... Magma Mace? What's that one? We summon an almost most violent tunnels the energy of your weapons, stun frozen in the meat and set them ablaze. Now, you know what? I might go for charge. Yeah, because we'll get the charge on us. That means we can kill creatures better. Okay. Who's one? Hello, my son. Bulldance. Oh, shit, yeah. So I'm ordering my retail copy of that tomorrow, like I said, in V. Fingers crossed, mate. I'll get early. Otherwise, there won't be no Bulldance content on my channel until possibly, like, the 18th or 19th. And even then, maybe not. I'm coming back from Italy on the 17th. Um, and then... Only a couple days later, I'm going to pick up my son. And he's coming down to my mum for a few days for the weekend. So I may not even be around until 22nd, really. My dog's on the... Uh, my dog's tripping. Look, at he's well um, speedy. Get here, doggo. Let's go and see what this is. Link Tuesday. Depends where you are in the country. That may be for tomorrow for you. They've said um, 5 a.m. If you're buying it on Microsoft on Tuesday. Well, that's what it said for me. 5 a.m. in the UK. So I'm guessing that's like... Oh, I guess that's that is tomorrow then, isn't it? If you're in America... Uh, I made a boo-boo. My two weapons are currently um, staffs. No, it's not. Poison. I swear I was still shooting my fireball. Guzman, your Daisy code. We'll have to wait till tomorrow, mate. You'll get it from Ash, the Natrado rep. He will sort out your code, son. It's a bit spooky, isn't it? It's atmospheric. Oh. That's it, I wasn't really holding on to it. Oh, my pet's fled. So that's the first time. <gasps> I died! Oh no! You lose H50 gold, resurrect in town. 
Resurrect at the entrance to this area, but lose 800 gold. You know what, we'll do that. Because we're not that far up. Okay, right, this one's a bit harder now. I've got to pay more attention. I'm a royalty. No, what's that, bro? Ooh. I does say level 10 to 12. I'm level 8. Maybe I'm here too early. We could do it. We do things. Nice. Okay, right. Paying attention now. Paying attention. I, I really don't like that poison. The poison um, attack. It's too slow. Where's the one that I was using? That's it. And I think I'll probably need some range. Oh right, you can't use the uh, the bow. What? What's going on with these weapons? I'm getting all confused. I'm getting confuzzled. Right, that's what I want. One. There we go. Why well, can't I have a cross? You can't have a bow in that slot. It has to go in that slot. Okay. Oh, so you press W. Okay. Let's try that a second. Right. I'm still going to put some sort of weapon here then. The shotgun's working, I guess. The shotgun was doing its thing. Scout gun, savage flame, and sh savage farm shotgun. Yeah, let's try that one. There you go. That's oh, really weird though. Alright, what else? Thank you for the follow, man. Vigor's okay, it's definitely done. Uh, I don't know, maybe a l little bit longer. Yeah, if you watch me on Mixer, check out my YouTube channel. To see videos of Torchlight. Same for Twitch as well. Just paying attention, paying attention. That's what we're talking about, boy. Man, don't know me. Oh, 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 getting maged up here. He's a big boy. Whoa! Oh shit! Where did they come from? Oh! Oh, mate! Oh! Oof! Oof! Nice, 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 nice. It's no problem like this, you can't see bugger all. Maybe there's a setting for that. I'm sh pretty sure there is a setting. Is he just gonna wait? My dog's just gonna wait. Oh. Got you, fam. Got you. My little doggo. Let's turn it off a second. He needs, uh,. Click for best help, shift and Z. Oh, there we go. Ah, that's it, so you just click on it and you heal him up. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. We're getting the hang of this, guys. We're getting the hang of this. Oh, man. Is this where I was earlier?
Mana is low. Oh, what's up, my love? So it pays to be speedy, so you can keep your recharge rate up. Oh, there we go. My mana's up. My mana's up. Use it, 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 use it. Just run out. Just run out. Woo! Potion. Did it? Took care of. Not enough mana. Oh mate, there's loads of bad guys. Go on, mate. My mana is low. Don't worry, I got you, fam. That's it. Yeah, unlimited, unlimited. More power. Did good job, doggy. Good job. some points let's put some points you know what yeah we'll have a couple more bosh there we go and then has he got any points Doggo got points skills I've got more skills Yeah, I'm gonna keep powering up my charge rate. That's pretty good, that one. Brendan, hello, mate. What, what you doing, boy? How you doing? You back in school yet? Not yet. Last few days of holiday. When do Americans go back? Kids go back this week. Don't come away from the bomb, dog. I love how the dog was like just sniffing the bomb. It's like, get away, boy, get away. Oh, shit. My mana is low. Yeah, I know your mana's low. I know, I know. My mana is low. There's a lot of offensive abilities. I'd like to see a few more. Um, I need some like passive regains and stuff. So it's the dungeons. Okay, we're near, we're near the next dungeon, I guess. Oh, I can't go this way. Right, I've got to go up that way. Mine started last Monday. I'm, I'm, I'm off now for the holiday weekend. Holiday weekend? What, what day is it? Is it like American Independence Day or anything like that? Floor one. Uh, no, okay. Just checking everything. I'm just checking. I don't want to risk losing it because if you die now, yeah, it's going to cost me money. I swear the original game, you couldn't lose. Uh, you could lose gold. So, yeah, you can get in situations where you're like way ahead of like where you should be and you'll get basically owned because you're, uh, you're going into places where the levels are just too much. They're too high. But, yeah, okay, right. Feeling good. Feeling good. Uh,. 12 seconds. Oh, the Prismic's pretty cheap, actually. Fifty percent chance of flip damage. That's a lot more damage. I'm going to switch up a little bit. Let's try doing the fire one. Yeah, let's go. Okay, here we go. Till Thursday. Ah, oh, well, hopefully everyone's safe. Lovely lady. 
Ai, juu, kyllä se oli. Always destroy urns. Even though it's tedious. It's like, look, it's, it really is like Borderlands. I mean, Borderlands came out before this, but the first one, I think, came out in 2008, Torchlight. So about, that was before Borderlands, the first one. Pretty sure, wasn't it? Oh no, not feeling it. Not feeling the fireball one. That's what I was going to do. I was going to check to see if I've got any items that I can wear that are better. I must have. I must have more items now. Like blue helmet. What's that one? Stoneborn. Five requires level 12. I'm still not level 12. I'm miles away from 12. Rejuvenating. This is what you want. Something that gives you extra health. No, there's nothing really there that I can wear. That's like any better. Adept. No. Focus. Or maybe, you know, no, 4% mana. Stuff that gives me mana is probably good. Ghastly boots. Oh, the ghastly boots are awful. Increasing magic finding luck conveys 5% chance to burn in 5 seconds. Mate, them boots are awful. They might be good as part of a set, but no. Yeah, and then I'm going to put a venom sign on it. So this is why you got to pay attention to your armor and stuff. Still haven't got any um, tunics and stuff that are pretty decent. No. Just scanning, guys. Just scanning. Got to make sure it's got to be done. Any decent necklaces? What's that one? Ooh, blood Ember Spark. 34% health. You know what? I'm going to have that one. Yeah, we'll have that one. And we're, we're going to put the eye on it. Can I not put the eye on that one? Requires item level 10. Oh, okay, only level 10. Okay. Alright, I think that's good. Light mantle. Yeah, we've increased the health now. How much is my health pool? 793. 93 mana. I'm getting, I'm getting well into this. It's quite nice. Right, that way. Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Ozzy Cook, good day, mate. Ah, oh, so did I, Ozzy. Yay, another person. Like, every person that comes in that's, like, happy or knows about Torchlight, I'm yet, yes. Because no one else really knows. Like, when I first streamed, people were like, oh, I've never heard of this game. And no one's watching it on Twitch. Like, if you type in Torchlight 2, no one's, no one's playing it. Maybe I can grow my channel just by being a, a torchlight streamer. You know what? There's worse things to be. Oh, there you go. W switches your guns out. There we go. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Okay. But yeah, mate, I'm excited. Obviously, it's PC. I can't wait to see what it looks like on console tomorrow. Oh shit. Mate. Something got me good there. I don't have enough mana. Take some potions, love. Oh, it's going down. it's getting it's getting busy now. I might be in trouble if I run into like a proper boss. I could be in trouble here. I'm just not high enough level. Definitely, like, visually, there's so much more flair around, like, the effects, the pop-ups, like, the, the counters, like, showing how much damage you've done. 
I'm actually really impressed. Especially as this game is like donkey's old. Oh, I've got to kill that guy. Go on, son. Have it up. There we go. That's what we're talking about. A bit more focused. Oh, they're like being possessed by something. Got to go and pick up all the loot. You must pick up the loot. It's the law. Labor Day, right? I get you. You got some neat gear. I will try that eventually. Oh, nice little chest. Yeah, good gold. Okay. Is that a fishing spot? Oh, what's that? Put like some magic. Yeah, look. Oh, secret ways. Nice. My inventory is full. Right, okay. We've, I can't carry anymore. We've got to do some we've got to do some shenanigans now. Do some shenanigans. And then we'll shut that. Pet panel. Right, let's just put all the crap on there, like I said earlier. Let's fill the pet up with junk that I don't want. Blast the boots. Shields. Shift bits transfer. Do it that way instead. Spear. Spear looks alright. Requires level 11. No, I'm still not that high. Yeah, we'll put all the red stuff there as well. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna have. Um... No, we'll have the shotgun. There we go. Can we have the shotgun slotted still somewhere like that? No. Okay. Okay. We, we did it. We did it. Got any other slots? No, no, no other slots. Cool. You got anything you can wear? Equipped. Level 3. Ooh, electrical armor. And ice damage. I might put that one on him instead. Yeah, might do that one. Okay. Oh, I finally got some uh, chest armor. Can I wear the chest armor? Yes, I can. Nice. A little pistol? No. I've got too many, too many uh, staffs now. Ooh. That gives me 40 health. But the other one gives me three extra mana. You know what? We'll, we'll, it's probably better to have high level gear as much as I can. Blue one. 34 health. Oh, that increases my health recovery. Oh, I'm putting that, taking that back off then. Okay, there we go. It's a loot simulator. Oh shit! Oh 
Oh, it's gold. Just learn it. When that comes. Secret room. My mana is low. Did I get anything there? Yeah, I did. Oh. We're gonna go. Skills. I'm gonna keep going for the charge. Because you're paying attention to that charge. If that keeps getting boosted up, it's gonna be good for you. So it's not, I, I don't think it's as satisfying using like a melee character with this. Maybe it will be good on con on controller, but it's quite nice using me, uh, me thing. Oh, am I here? Am I where, where I needed to be? Is this back to where I was? Yeah, okay, this we're back to where I was. Right, right, okay. So it's just a circle. Okay, right, let's go back upstairs now. Ah, hang on guys. Just make sure. This chat just quiet. It's just quiet. Still need to look into Mixer. Why it's not logging me on properly. Sign in. There we go. Signed into the right one now. You are live. There we go. My channel's alive. Check me, I've got seven followers on Mixer. It's an 18 plus stream. Yeah, I'll probably need to start putting some links if uh, I'm on Mixer if anyone is watching me. It's a big shout out. Go and check out my YouTube. I'm saying that it's probably you lot watching from like YouTube or stream. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, we're nearly we're nearly through this quest. We're gonna get we'll complete this mission and then we're gonna call it quits for the night. And yeah, come on, hit him, hit him. That's it. Nice. Oh, there's the scroll. Looks like it's the boss fight. Ah, more bombs. Looks like they're like wells that you might get some potions out of, but no, nothing like that. stuff here. Eh? 
identity scroll, nice. Ah. Here we go. Oh, oh shit, I just took a bit of paste in then. So this is it. This is where the Commander Vale was. So they came down here to investigate something. Don't know what really happened. It's a bit of an odd one, that. It's just teleporting miles away. Okay. Oh man, there's a big battle going on here. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. Stay away from him, stay away. My mana is low. Go, 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 Where's my dog? Shit. Shit. My mana is low. Take it at one. Go on, boy. Go on, boy. We got him, we got him. Yeah! Did it! Woohoo! Get in. That's good. Okay, we'll go down and talk to her in a minute. Let's make sure there's no extra loot anywhere. Maybe I could have traps here, because I, like, I can't get in. Zodi! Hello, mate! How do I get down to that ladder? Oh, there we go. And the chest's a little pretty, pro proper little secret, hidden. Oh, there you go, got boss chest, nice, loads of gold. Lovely jubbly. Anything else going on here? Here we go. No. This is the veil. I don't know who you are, but I'm glad you came along. We arrived just as the alchemist was subduing the guardian, but he caught us by surprise. We couldn't stop it. Grell and his raiders arrived shortly after the alchemist left. They've been trying to get in here and loot this place for years. The alchemist's attack finally gave them the opening they needed. Hmm. Should have known something was wrong with the alchemist. After we defeated Ordrak, our ember blight was cured. The alchemist just couldn't give up his experiments. The destroyer and I. We just pretended we didn't see the effect it was having on her. We made a terrible... Alright. Guardian of Water. I have my gratitude, Mortimer. Now listen closely. 
For a great evil is at work here. The Alchemist's search for a cure to his ember blight has driven him to the brink of madness. He siphoned off my energy to magnify the power of Ordrak's heart after he depleted it, destroying Torchlight. With the power of the Guardians, Ordrak's heart could destroy all ember everywhere. Perhaps he believes that might cure his affliction. Mm. The Alchemist must be stopped before he attacks any more Guardians. Each time he siphons off our energy, the heart becomes more powerful and Okay. You have a new quest. Did it. Did it, Ma? They are, they're really cool, aren't they? I'm, I'm really impressed. The first one was good, but it's been a while since I played it. And this is, like I keep saying, this is a game that's seven years old. There's loads of mods for this on PC as well, but obviously, I think the console version is going to look just as good. It does. So, I was saying earlier, Diablo came out, Diablo 3 came out, no one liked it at first. Had some awful decisions, uh, all sorts of things. We went wrong with that game when it first came out. At the same time, Torchlight came out, and people just jumped on a Torchlight bandwagon because it was like a little bit more simpler version, but people were loving it. That's where the Grand Regent was headed. If he's already reached the Watch Wheel, he'll have sealed the gates as a precaution, which means that the whole temple could be turning into one big plague zone even as we speak. Right, okay, so um, what can we have for reward? Cleveland hold gloves, or well, better than what I've got for sure. 5% all damage, 27 health, 1.6 mana recovery per second, requires level 20. Mm. I am a mage, so I should be going for anything that increases my mana recovery. But it's level 20, whereas this, I can wear it now. This is like the, the they get you every time. Requires level 10, or strength 21, and vitality 32. Hmm. My mana's. My mana is running out quite a lot, and I've been putting a lot of points into my mana. It's a special set, though, the Cloven Hoof stuff. We'll go with that one. We'll go for the this mana. Plague seems to specifically target beings of an inherently magical nature, such as the Tuesday. Guardians. And the Guardians. So far, it's not affecting humans, so I've sent for a transport to bring us some medical supplies, and I'll be coordinating the medical relief here. Meanwhile, you need to get out to the Watchwheel Temple. Take Crow's Pass to the Frosted Hills. Try to catch up to the Grand Regent before he enters the temple. You have received a quest. That was good. I've really enjoyed this. Getting used to the keyboard's been a bit iffy, but... We got there. I'm going to pick this up. I'm going to buy it. If I don't get a key by Tuesday, I'll buy one. Question is, what to play it on? Um, Josh really liked this. The first one. So I might pick up my Xbox and we can game share. I'm feeling having it on my Switch. I think it'd be cool to play this on my Switch. So I don't know how see it goes. Um, but yeah, thanks a lot, guys. Appreciate you tuning in for um, something that isn't survival. I am going to do some guides on this in the next few days, so you will see some more coverage. Um, and uh, yeah, if you're new to my channel, I can explain what all this is now as well. Um, yeah, welcome. Laters.
<laughs> I've been reading shit. <laughs> Sorry, guys. That cracks me up. I swear I pressed end stream. I don't know why it's still going. <laughs> Good thing I weren't doing anything stupid like picking my nose or looking up porn. <laughs> ah, I'll see you a lot later. <laughs>